Hi guys, um, I waited just a bit, just a few seconds ago, so I'm just going to use this time that I have right now to go through some other videos I've bought earlier this year that have been so vivid. Like, for example, Lord of the Rings. Now, I bought this, I didn't get the um, ring with it from Jake, I bought it from Jake Half, I didn't get the um, replica ring, which I really wanted so badly, so I actually got this one. Very nice box here, like, I just, as I said before my other video, that I just bought, um, Harry Potter, um, the number, the, um, limited edition numbered collection. Very similar to this, like, you open it up, like, according to, um, Francisco Bandino and Donald Russell, it was, it's very similar to this, and it's very much like, the, um, Ultimate Editions that came out in 2009 to 2010 to 2011. So, yeah, so, I'll just show you my, um, I love the rings. I love the rings. Correction. Is the front, the side, the back. I got this weird symbol. I don't know. I don't remember. I think I'm going to be the L for fine. And I get this. You get the map of Middle Earth. But at some point I can say. And you get our uh, main characters with Arwen, which she didn't really that much of a main character, but yeah, I guess why they put her. And so I just noticed that there there isn't like an that curve thing, like I've seen so many videos and so many like or even my friends that have this on blue I have that little curve here. I don't know, but I think I might be the other one, but it only comes that curve, but that's strange. Like, it's like, yeah, it would have a cut out there, but it, it isn't. I find it very weird, but here's the um, three individual Blu rays. The extension, so. It has a smell to it, too. It smells a bit weird. So, yeah. The first of the ring. Very narcissist, you know. Open it up and you get the booklet, which is exactly the same book as the DVD one. So I'll just show you this booklet. So, first you get this one. You get, um, and, um, the chapters, and you get the appendix thing, which is probably our fucking chapter, Charles the King, which is big, very nice, and that's it. So let's go back to, um, the first one playing. So you get Five discs in this regular blue ray, so you get disc one, disc two, part one of the footage features, part two in the behind the scenes one, which is um exclusive to this box set and exclusive to the two seven six um known to this thing. Um it's like, because this is actually my first copy of the Lord of the Rings trilogy. I've only had the, the first movie on VHS, that's it. So, yeah, I never had them on DVD. So, next generation. So, I bought this like ages ago, but I never got a chance to do this on the internet. But, yeah. Um, so yeah, the book, I probably won't show you this, it'll take forever, but. Yeah, you just get like appendix, and the same as the DVD one, like, yeah, like the extended DVD, so, you get part one, part two, so, I find it weird, because, I find it a bit weird, because on this Blu-ray, like, they have part one and part two, and Blu-ray can actually, I don't know why they do it on two discs, like, they could, they actually do have the effort to put them on, one whole this whole movie, but 
I don't know why it is. It's really annoying to actually take this here and put this back in. It's really annoying. But I don't know why the hell I do that. Yeah, parts. We have the special pieces. Mm. The journey continues. Part 4. The battle for, more, for Middle Earth begins in Helm's Deep. And uh, behind the scenes are the two towers. And the Return of the King. One side back. Now I don't know. Oh, actually, I decided the DVD versions had the hacker thing because the for in the original these are just coming in the Blu-ray case. I wish they were coming out like a Disney book free film, like Harry Potter has. Like we got actually have a, like a Disney book out. That would be cool. Like that's what I did with more Rings. So. Um, the DVD one, but no, I just get to do it cases, so, part one, part one, part two, this, this. part five of the special features, the war of the wing, part six, passing of an age, and part, okay, and part, oh yeah, and the door behind the scenes of the return of the king. Um, the special features and everything is the same as the DVDs, and I was really hoping that they'll give us like a bonus disc of like um a bonus disc like a sneak peek at the Hobbit coming out next year. Like that would be cool, ad, but they didn't. They just gave us the same stuff, but in high definition. So yeah, um, I like it's very very nice to like the picture quality, everything. So nice, like they definitely did the um Johnny remastered remastered and like it it's such a it's a really nice box that so, like I highly recommend it. Um I just love it, like it's such like it's good to watch these films on this, like it's very nice, like the best version you can watch Lord of the Rings on. I'll probably give it ten out I'm going to give it nine out of ten. No, 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 it would have been 10 if they would have given us something new, but not enough 10 and give it. So, but I actually highly recommend you buy this. It's a good box set. So, thanks for watching and bye. And if you want to see more, subscribe. I've already gotten 3 subscribers. So, thanks for watching.